Aries, Scorpios. <coughs> so I'm going to do an X reading to see if it's likely that your X will come back, okay? And this is going to be for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs for November 13th through the 20th. And look what we have there, guys, when I split the deck. Three of Cups, which is Union, Happiness, Gatherings, Party, and Reciprocal Love with the Two of Cups there. So, good sign. Very good sign. A lot of water going on here. Like it. Right now. <laughs> okay. Six of Pentacles. Sharing. Working together. Ooh. Devil energy there. Mm, I feel like it's passion though. That's what I feel. All right, let's see. Is it likely that Scorpio's ex will come back? Please show me. Scorpio and your ex. Scorpio and their ex. All right, Scorpio, let's see what's going on with you guys right now. All right. Okay, something wanted to flip there, but it didn't. Yeah, it's got some jumping cards here. This is you, Queen of Cups. Beautiful, beautiful, very intuitive. And they are the Three of Cups. Well, isn't that something? Got Cancer energy here. Here you are, Queen of Cups. Very uh, intuitive, very loving. Um very nurturing here very sweet i feel like very mild mannered hmm what you want to be happy to be happy and i feel like you you want to be happy within yourself and I feel like you are I feel like you are I feel like you don't really need anybody else at this point but you know if the right person comes along then I feel like you know you are more than open to it what they want is six of wands acknowledgement success is what they want Hmm. That's what they want. What you need is to lay down any burdens that's holding you back, that's making you feel less than. Okay? Anything that you have been um, carrying, like a bag lady, lay it down. Lay it down. It's not serving you. And I feel like that's what you're doing. We have Sagittarius here, Pisces here, Cancer, Leo. Those are the energies that are present, okay? What they need <laughs> is to stand in their, their masculine energy and come towards you. Let you know that they're willing to, you know, bear whatever they need to along with you to make this union work. They need to be the emperor. Aries here. Hmm. Is this union likely? Five of Pentacles. Mm, it's not a very good card um, for determining whether or not this union is likely because both of you feel that you were um, left out in some way, um, hurt in some way, like the other did something to really, really offend you know, the other one. So at this point, for the 13th through the 20th at least, um, I don't see any movement. 
at all. Um, this person is quite possibly, you know, going out with friends as well because I don't really see, you, I feel like you were feeling this way a lot at one point. But now I feel like this energy, this Five of Pentacles energy is more with the other person on this side. And they're doing what they can right now to get out of this feeling. I don't feel like it's a three-party relationship. If it is, it just involves friends and, you know, just trying to take their mind off of things. It's the way I feel. But they want to move past that. I feel like this person also, you know, with the Six of Wands here as well, with the Three of Cups, it's like they are around a lot of people. And I feel like it's just um, a cover, a blanket, like a, you know, a comforting source for them. But they have to address this Five of Pentacles energy right here and stand up and be the emperor, okay? So let's go ahead and pull a Divine Feminine Oracle card for you guys. Joan of Arc, I think Libra. Libra got this as well. The warrior of light, I have a still like faith in myself. The angels armor me with conviction. Love it. Queen of Cups there. Here you are. Keep your wits about you, about you and just stay confident. You know, just, just keep doing what you're doing because it seems like you're moving to a much better um, place here. I'm going to pull an angel prayers card. We have the inner voice. Thank you, angels, for guiding me through my inner voice. Yes, I feel like you are very intuitive. And I feel like you listen to and you see the signs here. And I feel like this person is, is this is like a prompt for, for the other person to also use their intuition when it comes to um, not only this situation, but in, you know, life dealings in general here. Okay. So Scorpio, that is what I have for you guys for the 13th through the 20th. And I will be speaking with you soon.